about what? A girl got killed in Hadfield. It's on the radio. Hold on. Then the police have cordoned off the entire area. To repeat, three teenagers have been found murdered in a house in the northwest section of Haddonfield. The names of the teenagers have not been released. I can't believe it. I know. We probably knew her. Where did it happen? Down on Orange Grove. That's right down the street. I know. Sally, I can hear the sirens coming. They said the guy got away. Do they know who it was? No. Jerk. This guy got you all worked up tonight. Am I the only one who listens to the radio? Some kids got killed on Orange Grove. Oh, anyone we know? Uh, what are you doing here anyway? I thought you were grounded. Snuck out. Oh, and you decided to come see me? Mm. You know, you could have gone drinking with Bennett Tramer and his band of meatheads. Ben Schramer? Mm -hmm. You know I can't stand that guy. Oh. Besides, it's much more fun to sneak out to see you instead. If you were any sweeter, I'd get a cavity. Mm -hmm. Besides, it can't be that hard to sneak out of your grandparents' house. I have to shout every time I say hello. Yeah, Pop was asleep in front of the TV when I left. Some, uh, scary movie was playing. And what of Norma? No idea. She was in the kitchen. I snuck out the window. I got beer. <gasps> My hero. So, is the, uh, doctor in? No. He went to a Halloween party and then he has to go to work. So we have the whole house to ourselves tonight. Oh. Well, how copacetic. Get off me, you lug. Aye, aye, Miss Mixter. So, the doctor's out. My grandparents are hanging on by a senile thread. Mm -hmm. Townsfolk are getting chopped to bits. Fingers crossed on Bennett Trainer. <laughs> and we got beer. So I guess that leaves just one thing left for us to do. Oh, yeah? What's that? I'm gonna fuck your brains out. Mm -hmm.
Damn, that was bomb. <laughs> you weren't so bad yourself. <laughs> now, go get me a beer. <laughs> you get me a beer. I just did all the work. And yet the job still isn't finished. Hmm. <laughs> Fine. I'll go get you a beer. Yeah. You know, Linda says that Bob gives her multiple orgasms. Mm. Must be nice. Is it just me or do I not have my beer yet? <laughs> <laughs> you jerk. How did I get so lucky? Make sure it's a cold one. Extra hot, I hear you loud and clear. Such a bitch. <laughs> totally. I wish I had you all alone. Just the two of us. Dad? Pete? Pete! What? Pete! Come quick! What? Just hurry up already! God. Good now. I'm coming, I'm coming! Oh, my track star boy friends. <laughs> hurry up! What? Look! What? what? Why is the door open? Well, I don't know. I didn't open it. Huh. Freaky deaky. <laughs> well, aren't you gonna close it? Yes, dear. It was probably just the wind. It was probably just the wind? Yes. <laughs> Halloween's really got you on edge, hasn't it? The escaped lunatics got me on edge. You act like it's the boogeyman or something. I just freaked out is all. Say, go make sure all the doors are locked, will you? Yes, your highness. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, while I'm at it, I think I'm gonna call Haddonfield police myself and see if I can't get Chair Prackett to uh, come down and personally patrol the premises. <laughs> and better yet, I'm gonna buzz the horn over to Russellville Precinct and just see if they can get the whole squadron to come on down and protect this little Sally Mixter. And if the boogeyman does get you, your pop will just stitch you back up again. Asshole. You know, this could have all been avoided if you had just gotten me a beer in the first place. <laughs> I guess I'll get my own beer. Hey, what good are you anyway? Sal. Sal, are you up there? Mm. You better get your ass ready for round two. My little mouse. <laughs> well, well. I've never seen you more beautiful. <laughs> Sally, Sally. Are we going for round two or not? Sally? 
Let's go. So you gotta quit these freaky games. Fine. Stay in there all night. Ah! What the fuck? What the? Shit. Come and get me, asshole. If you have the guts. Lots 
Lots of wavy hair like Liberace. 